Hey, my name is Dr. Knott. Welcome back to Hacknet. And today, well, what are we going to do today? We're going to do more hacking. But specifically, we've got Slashbot News Network. So let's take a quick uh, look at our email. So this is from Entropy. This is what we have to do to get into the club. The Entropy Club. Okay, so let's quickly read the blah, 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 blah. A tabloid news server has recently taken a negative stance towards Entropy. So we don't, they just basically want us to take out the message board. This is not a request to simply wipe the server clean of articles. We just want that program brought down. Okay, sure. Entropy group engaged in malicious hacking slash bot news. So here's the article. Recent reports suggest that the internet group Entropy has recently taken to sheltering and providing work for, in, for a notorious hacker. Could that be Bit? We also know of Tex. So two people in the group, at least, well, there are more, but two people we know of. While this information cannot be confirmed yet, if it is, the group will be sure to face severe legal action in the near future. In the eyes of this reporter, this represents a clear act of betrayal towards the network that allows productive groups to thrive and should be punished severely. Reporter Tom Wilkins. All right new Microsoft phone about as bad as you expected. <laughs> it seems Microsoft just can't catch a break. Its new waterfall phone, which our staff were fortunate enough to acquire from an anonymous benefactor, has been found to have some pretty serious security flaws. Users of the phone can expect the same buggy last-gen OS they've grown accustomed to from the ubiquitous tech giant. But now with gaping security holes to boot, any installed apps are able to easily gain unrestricted control of the phone, and the networking bug could lead to private data being sent unencrypted all over the net. Waterfall, Microsoft's fourth generation phone, is expected to launch two weeks from now. But with this discovery, experts say the launch may be delayed by up to a month. Watch this space for any future developments. Oh, Microsoft, not Micropuff. Suspicions arise over Entropy. Oh, so we've got two, two articles here. Internet group Entropy has been renowned, renowned for some time as a reliable source of inf information on recent developments in the internet world. However, recent actions by the group, such as the shutdown of their public access terminal after the means of which they had been procuring this information was called into question, has aroused the suspicions of reporters and companies alike. Okay, Tom Wilkins, that is all one sentence. What? Although the group has long been a credit to the openness of information, if it has been doing so by illegitimate means, action must be taken. More news as the situation unfolds. Alright, alright, Tom Wilkins does not like us. Or, does not like Entropy, we're not part of Entropy yet. We're so close. Is your data at risk? Popular social network Friendhole <laughs> was the latest victim of a malicious hacking group apparently bent on compromising all forms of social media. The group's identities and locations still remain a mystery to cyber police, but their message is clear. Nothing is safe. Face spaces... Wait, is it friend hole or face space? Right. Face spaces CEO attempted today to reassure a nervous user base, explaining that face spaces security is watertight, and that the only people who will have access to users' personal data on face space are them, those they choose to share it with, and face spaces 12,000 trusted advertising partners. Okay, fair enough. And new Opbowl dongle patent will tantalize fanboys. Hardcore Opbowl fans, get your affairs in order and prepare your wallets. A new patent filed by technological golden child Opbowl Computing today suggests that the company could be moving into the home console market. Patent for an extensible dongle could be a component in a new gaming system, experts say. Perhaps a controller or, or motion sensor. As of yet, only the design, a telescoping cylinder with rounded ends, has been granted patent status, but our sources say news on the device's functionality may only be a few days away. Watch this space. Okay, not not too much happening in Slashbot news. Let's see, so what we want to do... What I'm going to have to do... Let's, I'll type in terminal. No, 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 no. Stop. Just kidding. Okay. We're going to get rid of that note. We're going to go back. I need to get my crib notes open because I don't remember 
everything off the top of my head. I know this is bad, but that's that thing up there. Okay, we got that one. There we go. Okay, this is what we want to do. Okay, so let's go back to our little Slashbot news network. And we're going to come over here. We're going to probe the system. All right, so now we need to do SSH hack crack ssh crack 22 cannot execute proxy active oh the proxy's active so what i probably have to do is go through on all these computers and shell it up right which will mean i have to get rid of something here to get all these shells can i shell over here too how many can i shell looks like i can shell can i shell entropy as well i'm gonna shell everything i can can I shell here? That's not possible, is it? Yeah, I didn't think so. So they're blocked. We can shell all these ones that we have access to. I probably should get rid of these logs. Can I shell the mail? No. So then if I come over here and we try that again. Yeah, we have to we have to get past the the active uh sorry the a port hack open additional ports i have to open this port to hack it and in order to get how do i overload with these ones i have to oh i'm doing it oh okay so i just press some of these overloads and i can get past it there we go that's i, I didn't i think i did this before and i didn't notice all right so now we can SSH crack port 22. But I need to, if I close these now, will these be bypassed still? I think so. Let's close all of these shells. There we go. So I'm not sure, we just want to take down the message board, right? That's all. Scan for adjacent nodes. I think when we scan, it's already... Oh, we need admin access. We need a port hack. So we'll do that to port 22, I imagine. There we go. We come over here and we can... Probably in the system, I just... I'm going in circles now. Go back. Let's scan. Scan complete. Okay. Now, I want to view the logs. We're going to have to get rid of this. Here's the message board. So I just want to completely get rid of this. Let's look through what there is here. So these are our logs. Nothing in the bin. System. Default. Slash bot news. Okay. Message board. Listings. So those are the five things we read. Nothing enclosed. Configure system. Nothing's going on there. Do not delete or rename it. Okay, so configure system in this folder is a critical system file. Do not delete or rename it. Doing so will crash the board and bring the host program down. Changes to the config should be made only during scheduled outages. So we just have to delete this file. That's what I'm getting at here. So clearly d delete or remove config.system. That should bring down the board. I come over here and then I remove the whole thing. We're going to delete all of our logs, log files, and we're going to get out. I think that's all we have to do. Boom. If I do anything else, it'll be logged, so let's get out, go back to the mail. If I click up here, I'm already logged in. Apply. Let's, uh. No more messages, homies. Oh, we did it. Greetings, Dr. Knott. Congratulations. Your timely execution of your first contract has proved your abilities, and I can now gladly welcome you to Entropy. As a small welcoming gift, you'll find the user details of the admin account to your asset server attached. Help yourself to any programs you might need, and view our, our mantra. Yeah, yeah. 
Once you're geared up, reply to this address and I will arrange a true test of your abilities. Again, congratulations, text. So this is their server with a bunch of stuff. This is... Okay, so user's admin password rosebud. We should be logged in now. I just read it, right? Admin rosebud. Okay. Can I hack this? I don't know if... Ah! That's probably not good. What is this? Oh god. I need to... Oh god. <laughs> so don't hack them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Um... How do I get rid of this? They have, this is a, oh shoot. Dude, I was just joking. I was just joking. Clear. Ah! <laughs> um, 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 Do I, do I need to get out? Okay, so just get out, right? Oh, I have to just leave. Okay. <laughs> We're not going to do that, even though I already hacked the system. I'm not doing that. Okay. Even though now I'm really curious. Okay, what do we got here? FTP bounce. What does that do? What's your mantra? Entropy mantra. Our group is founded on three pillars, which we strive to follow in all things. One, strive for justice and righteousness in all things. Okay. Two, create and share more than you destroy. Three, never have an excuse not to improve. Entropy will deny contracts that go against these pillars and remove agents that violate them. Ugh. Okay, that's scary. Um, I'll just download it, I guess. SCP FTP bounce. I'm gonna download all the. Uh, okay, if I can spell. I'm just gonna download download all the programs in case I need them. We're gonna delete that in a sec. Yeah, there's FTP bounce and SSN or wait, we already have that, right? Okay. Okay. And then we'll uh, remove our log. Show us not, you know, trying to hack their system. And then we just reply to that email when we're ready. If we go back to our computer. Like I wish I could. So if I run if I run a program, how do I do that? I think we just type it right. FTP bounce.exe. Oh, I need to like. Uh, okay. Let me just. I'm just curious as to what this does. Maybe I don't. So we have port 22. That's oh, not even open yet. Okay, so we're gonna crack P. Ander Anderson's bedroom PC and we're gonna FTP bounce it. Because I'm just curious as to what that does. Like I really don't know. FTP bounce 22. Target port running incompatible service. Oh, it has to be an FTP server. Doink. Okay. All right. Slow learner I am. Um, let's reply with, give me your best shot. Ooh, that's right. Throw some shade. All right, the response. Dr. Not, excellent. I'd like to be the first to formally invite you to begin accepting entropy contracts. Attached is the location of the group's secure contract database, along with login credentials necessary to access it. Feel free to accept and complete initial contracts at your leisure. I'll be in contact again to gauge your progress soon. Text. Okay, so... 
Doctor Knot and Rosebud. That's gonna be our our uh, th our thing. Username, Doctor Knot. Rosebud. All right, so we've got. We'll just go down the line. Point clicker. Well-meaning client needs some of his data from a game server deleted to regain productivity. Wait. A well-meaning client needs some of his data from a game server deleted to regain productivity. Sure. Greetings, civilian. I've been put in a dire predicament here, and unfortunately no one in my incompetent office of staff is capable of fixing this issue for me. This has forced my hand to resort to outside help, as distasteful as that is to me. Informants have assured me this line is secure, so I'll be brief. I have bested the game point clicker, and wish to prove my clear dominance over it again, if there is not, there is no reset button. I'll need you to enter their server and delete my save file so that I may crush it once more. My username is Mengsk, Mengsk? Can I write that down? Um, add note. Username equals M, what is it? M-E-N-G-S-K, right? M-E-N-G-S-K. Feel free to bask in the glory of my current achievement before resetting. Dismissed, M. Okay. So there's our note. Game's sitting over here. Oh, okay, there you go. Point clicker. What is this? I mean, I have zero points. Can I play? Your glorious click points ex empire begins. Click, click, click. Wait, are you serious? What? It's just a clicker. This is what this person does? <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, now we can auto upgrade. Look at this. Maybe I'll just beat this guy's, uh, okay, anyway. So, can we probe this thing? There we go. So we have the SSH rack, which is always 22, it appears. I want to try the the uh, FTP thing as well. FTP bounce 21. Oh, it's doing it. I just want to see what's up with this, you know. It's taking a second. We got it. What's up here? go back okay so we've probed the system we can port hack the thing that should give us access here right wait no I don't want to want to go even though I do have the auto clicker which is pretty awesome we need what do we need 130 okay anyway um Go back to probe, I guess. Okay, so we can go back here. There we go. So, let's scan the network. Scan's complete. I don't really know what that does. Let's go here. Home. New folder 69. IRC log. Jeebus! The bishop came to our church today. Jeebus. He was a fucking impostor. Jeebus. Never once moved diagonally. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Never once moved diagonally. Sounds like an imposter, yeah. Point clicker. Saves. Alright, so we need to delete this dude one. This one right here. This is not his score. Holy hell. Okay. So we just need to delete his save right here. So we just go remove M-E-N-G-S-K dot P-C-S-A-V. 
icon. Remove. We were never here. I do want to check out the FTP, so I'm going to have to probably come back and delete the log, I would suspect. There are no logs. Okay, good. But there will be now, and we're going to... Let's, what is this? What can I do here? What can I do with this? Open ports required for crack, too. I'm not sure what this does yet. We'll have to figure that out, so we don't need that anymore. Let's go back. Let's... Okay, there are no logs. Perfect. Um, okay, it's been accepted. What do I do to respond? Dude, crush that point clicker. Again. Nice. Congratulations, the client of your recent contract has reported a success and is pleased with your work. You are now free to accept further contracts from the contact database. Your current ranking is 80 out of 100. Thank you, Entropy. Huh? What does that mean? Is that is that good? Or do I need to get a higher or lower number? I don't even know. Okay. Where is our... This is going to get unwieldy here. Which one is it? This one. Am I going to have to log in every time? There you go. Good. The famous counter hack. We recently got news of a company hiring less well-meaning hackers to retrieve some sensitive data from a rival corporation for exploitative purposes. In the interest of dissuading companies from using the hacker community in such ways in the future, we're going to ensure their transaction doesn't go smoothly. All right, let's do it. Agents, the company PP Marketing hmm. recently hired a freelance hacker to break into a rival company's servers to retrieve some sensitive data, which we believe to be a mailing list. That hacker transferred the data to PP and ruined it for the actual creators. Naturally, this sort of corporate espionage is exactly the sort of business that gives hacker groups their bad reputation. But while we're not really even interested in policing this in its entirety, the blatant advertising of the job across the net makes this one a little more public, makes this one a little more public, so we'd like to ensure it doesn't pay off for PP. We don't know exactly what the file's called, so you might have to do a little digging once you're in there. You're looking for a stolen mailing list. It might be archived or encrypted. We want it deleted. We should also note that the company may be prepared for this eventuality. It might have some security countermeasures in place. Entropy admins. So once we get in there, we have to, like, really go. Cannot execute. So this is us. Oh, because they have a proxy. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is taking way too long, so we need to do this a little faster, so let's get out. Ugh, okay, so every time we go in there, they're going to have that going on here. They have the trap on. Alright, so what we need to do is get a few more, I think, to overload. Let's close that one for a second. Ah. Nope, we're not using that one. I think if we get a few entropy, entropy, asset server, can't read these things. Um, shell this thing too. Critical error. Oh yeah, we did that, didn't we? So the whole message board is down. Nice. Um, all right, let's go. Oh, 
Go, 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 go. All right, so now we can SSH back 22. We're going to have to get out of here. Ah, flip. So we're looking for a mailing list, right? Okay, we're in. No, we're not in. Oh my god. Port hack. Open additional ports on target machine. Oh, we need two. Okay, so that's what this this other one is. FTP. So we're just opening the port so that we can then target things. I see. So there's not really much. So this is gonna waste like 15 seconds. I guess this isn't really seconds, is it? Okay, so now we can do our port hack. Okay. This? Secure mailing list? This is the mail list we got. Okay, so... We charge through by the nose. It turns out there's some sort of encryption on it. We did... What do we even pay this guy for? So what I'm gonna do, actually... What is this? Ow! Oh! I don't know what that means. DEC extension. Let's quickly look. We've got enough time, right? Were you logging into the S3 on the weekend? No, why? There are files missing and our bandwidth usage is off the charts, but there are no logs. That's weird. Did you check to see if the firewall is down? Not yet. Shit. What? RDP to the mail server is down. Going to the server room to check it out. BRB. Okay. Okay, I'm packaging everything up and sending it through. I'll store it off-site and we can retrieve it later. This is total BS, by the way. Can't believe they go through our security. Months of emails gone. I bet Letterman is going to be pissed about this. Weinstein is probably going to flip his lid. To make sure you don't get fired too, I'll talk to you later. We're gonna have to delete the logs. Okay. So what do we have? We're gonna remove... Secure... Stop beeping at me. Secure... It's like the movies, you know? <laughs> Mail list uh, DEC. Also gonna remove mail list info.txt. We're gonna go to the log. We're gonna remove the whole thing. And we're gonna get the heck out of here. Yeah, it looks like we're cool. So if we come back here... The PP is no more. What I mean is I deleted the mailing list... ...per your request. A peesh? <laughs> Don't know how to spell that. Congratulations, the client of your recent contract has reported a success and is pleased with your work. Okay, so we can accept further. Your current ranking is 60 of 100, so I think we need to do three more. That's what I'm getting from this. So, I think we're going to knock out the next three in the next episode. So thank you for watching. We're becoming real-life hackers. I'm so proud of us. I'm talking in the plural for me. I don't even know. Whatever. It's because you're all part of this too. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care, and goodbye. Uh-huh.